Grace and peace, y'all. Happy Tuesday. So, I'm getting Botox today. And I'll come back to you all and talk to you all about it. But yeah, I'm doing it. Grace and peace, you all. Happy Thursday. Happy Thursday. So, this is my maintenance week. And we got our hair done. Um, so, I have the Bohemian Knotless braids. And I'll show you all those when I get home. I just got 32 units of Botox. So I'm super excited about that. I got it here, here, and here. So I'm excited about that. Um, I get my nails done Monday. <laughs> and let me see, my nails done Monday. We got, we and we had a laser appointment. I did all of those things. Um, so I'm going to put, my discount code if you all want to go to um milan um laser and hair removal and then for my botox i went to forever young so i went here i don't know if they have that in your area but that's where i went today like just right now So yeah, so I just thought I will pop on here and share that with you all. I'm doing all the things that make your girl happy. I'm taking care of me because we cannot pour from, from an empty cup. We have to take care of ourselves so we can take care of our loved one. I'm actually a uh, I'm actually about to drive um, by our house and look at the um, progress of that. And then I am going to have lunch. I'll give you all an OTD, which I'm just wearing. Um, I have my coach bag and um, I'm just wearing my jogging suit and my Nikes and all of that. Um, that's what we're about to do now. We are about to go ahead to the new house and let me put in the um, directions and look at that. Um, So yeah, what are you guys doing? How are you all doing? Um, I'm trying to put the directions on um, on the map. She said, "See now, I want to touch my face." Okay. So yeah, um, I'm about to leave. I'll see you all later, okay? I'm about to, I already got my seatbelt on. Okay, we about to head out. Oh, and I have some new products I wanna share with you all, but I made me a matcha before I left the house. Mm. And it is so good. But okay, I'm blabbing now. Let me go and I'll um I'll come back. Okay, y'all. As promised, this is not our house, but this the exact plan of our house that we're building. So this the exact plan plan apples for apples. So when you walk in our front door, you will be in the foyer and you um can see straight ahead like the kitchen area. So yeah.
and then this is a bedroom downstairs um, on the first floor so it looks like this and then it has its own bathroom and then it has a little bitty closet okay so then when you walk out this is a coat closet this will be my office or you can use it as a dining room however i am going to use mine as an office and then you turn left here and this is like the mud room this is um the garage and all of that stairs here we have the living room eating kitchen it's like open concept so it looks like this so it looks like that and then we're gonna head upstairs we chose like everything like basic um in our in our home so then we walk upstairs this is the loft area and then this way is a bathroom another bathroom which will be my daughter bathroom here is another room and this will be her room no matter how the um rooms are it might just be flipped and here go a closet so heading back out it's another bedroom right here And we go down the hallway. Here is a big linen closet that really excites me. Then right here is the laundry room. Then we just go right here. Here is another bedroom. I love this bedroom. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love this bedroom. And then I'll take you all to the master suite. So right here, because this is a model, you don't have a door, but that's okay. <laughs> so this will be the room. So it either be flip when you walk in hours. So they did um, like an accent wall, chandelier, and everything like that. And then it will be another door here. This is the master bathroom. So then you have the water closet, the shower, the double sinks, another linen closet for the master. And then you have this big walk-in closet, which I already decided to give my husband a walk-in closet. So yeah, let me sit down and talk to you all for a minute. So yeah, I'm talking to y'all in this model home. This is a five bedroom, three and a half bath home. Um, it's two stories. Um, and what else I wanted to tell y'all? I think that's it. This, like what 
what I'm showing y'all now is exactly how our house is going to look minus the furniture. I just wanted to show y'all um, what this looked like because I don't know that I'm going to do a house tour right away. Um, so yeah, I'll go ahead, post this video for y'all and we'll see you all the day we close. I'm super excited. So yeah. Okay, y'all, so I'm out running errands and I said I needed to charge my car. We were on 40%. So I had to pull over to a charger and we at 53% right now. So I said, you know, I'll come out here and talk to you all, have my lunch. I, ha I am having a cheeseburger from Portillo's Okay, do your Cadillac charge up too, sir. Yep, his Cadillac charge up. And I'm on a fast charger too. Uh, I'm on a fast charger. So yeah, um, I'm excited. So we're charging and dang it's charging real fast like oh my god this is the first week we've had this truck and it's charging super fast that Cadillac is that a Cadillac that is really nice let me flip it over flip my camera over and show y'all <clears throat> hold on y'all this Cadillac is every bit of a nice, honey. It is really nice. So yeah, we're at 55% now. Like this thing is charging so fast. Oh my God. Like it's charging super fast. And we have the Volvo C40 recharge and it is a 2024. So yeah. I'm gonna sit y'all here. Hold on. Yeah. I'm out and about. I have um, everything in my car ready to push the button and shop and pay for it. I just have things in the cart. I order some things. I'm going to do one big haul. I'm going to put a poll up and y'all vote. Do y'all want to, because I'm not going to unbox anything because it don't make sense to unbox anything right now. Uh, I just probably open the package and make sure that it's not damaged because of the time frame we looking at. But I'm going to put a poll up and y'all vote if y'all want one haul the day of moving. And we schedule our movers already. Um... So the day we close, it's the same day we're moving in. I have the cleaners coming in there that that day. And then we're also moving that day as well. So it kind of worked out. And that's why I'm buying everything now that um, I can and have delivered to, um, have delivered to our storage unit. Um, <clears throat> So yeah, it's a couple things that I ordered from RH that I'm glad I ordered it now because I'm the type of person, I want my furniture when I move in. I really don't want to have to wait. So it's I'm glad that I was able to pay for a couple things that I wanted from RH because they won't even be delivered until, I think with, uh, until like March. Now, Indianapolis, just we just got a RH outlet, and I'm so excited about that. And we just got a RH restaurant. So, I'm going to be doing content and stuff like that at the RH restaurant. Um, I'll take y'all in the RH outlet, too, sometime. I went in there, and I bought, I purchased something from the RH outlet because it was cheaper there than at the online 
and um, I bit the bullet and went ahead and paid the fee to become a member so I could get the member pricing, which sometimes that is a big help. So I only have like a couple things that's coming from our age. But my bedroom set, I'm getting that. Well, it's not a set, but the bed itself, RH outlet have that for a fr I mean like it's real cheap at the outlet so I think the bed if you're not a member it's like seven thousand um, dollars I think with being a member it ain't that much difference and then at the outlet it was like two thousand dollars so you can't beat that with a baseball stick so the dressers was the same price um they were kind of expensive online and um the nice stands, the bachelor hutch was the same price everything at the outlet was um cheaper so our bedroom is coming from our age i have the lamps for the bedroom and the living room coming from our age um I believe the table and the I think the living room tables are coming from RH if I'm not mistaken. Um I ordered my daughter well I ordered a sample of the wallpaper um because I just want to make sure it looks good with the fabric. I'm buying her bed from um Pottery Barn Team even though we don't have that store here we just have pottery barn kids we went in there and we looked at the fabrics me and her we did that the other day and i asked the lady i said she was like well i could order it online i said i can too but <laughs> i said before i bite the bullet i just want to make sure that the wallpaper is going to look good with that fabric so i got the wallpaper from etsy so i'll be sharing that with you all because we have that's what i forgot to do i went right to the house and didn't measure the walls to order her wallpaper that was the whole purpose of me coming out here i had no tape measure anyway i'm, pr I'm pretty sure i could have did something on my phone but yeah so let me see what else um we're going to go into our house after we're charged up dang this is a summer driver we already at 62 <laughs> percent so we are going to go in our house um because i want to look at um i want to look at some stuff in our house and um just i want to look at everything before i order it online because i just want well, to look at it because this time I am buying pieces that are timeless and that are going to last and I'm buying quality versus quantity and I know y'all gonna say well it's, it's it's dupes out there you know don't spend all your money and you know buying you know you really just paying for the name the furniture itself is good um is a good quality and that's one thing i love about rh i don't care what nobody say rh have good quality furniture and it's going to last you know what i'm saying our house does too pottery barn crate and barrel and all of that they have good quality furniture not that it's anything wrong with you know like wayfair amazon all that because it's not you know i just was like you know what your girl is almost 50, right? And I just want to live my best life. And I'm not saying this is our forever home, but we're going to be here for a while. And I want to be comfortable. I don't want to be house poor. And um, I want to enjoy my home. So that's why I'm working so hard. Not saying my husband not working hard either but that's why me personally i am working so hard behind the scenes and have not been on social media i've been working my butt off because i really want my stuff i want my furniture and you know um things needed to happen and it calls for me to come offline like i don't even know i might go ahead and post this video for sunday upload just to say you know i'm back this what's been going on with me behind the scenes like a little life update 
but I don't know when I'm actually like for real for real because i'm doing a lot behind the scenes when i tell y'all i'm doing a lot behind the scenes like i'm working with an attorney to get my business trademarked like the name is nobody have my name that i want for my business um so that's the first thing like i'm on everything legal not saying none of my other business have not been legal but this particular business is my livelihood I need all my T's crossed and all my I's dotted. Um, I need to be in compliance with the whoever I need to be in compliance with. And um, I said, even though I have my EIN number right, I said, Lord, I still want to be trademarked. So my business is working, um, is going through the process of being trademarked. And then, um, to God be the glory, you know, this time next year, I will be working from home full time. Okay. So I'm just excited about some things. Um, I just been doing a lot of things and I'm excited because honey, I want to retire at 55. Okay. I'm going to retire at 55. So um, it, I had to do a lot of stuff. I had to move things around. I mean, I just had to do a lot of things so your girl could be set up. Like, my husband was like, wow, you were really out there. He said, babe, I'm so proud of you because you out there, you making things happen for our family. I want, listen, this time around when I got married, I said, you know what, Lord? I want to be a housewife. I want to walk around in my house in my robe. <laughs> <laughs> sipping on my coffee doing all the things i don't want the hustle and the bustle of punching somebody clock no oh i forgot i can't touch my face i don't want that so yeah i'm, I'm just super excited what god is doing every time i turn around god just blows my mind like y'all don't even know half of the stuff that I've been through and then my husband had to go through it because he's married with me since I got off of social media before the new year came in like I've been through so much but I'm so grateful I'm so thankful um, that I went through those things because it has humbled me number one number two I think it made me a better person overall um, and it get dang, he charged that quick and it gave me a little patience I'm still asking God for the patience. Like, so much stuff has happened. Like, oh my God, I need to just sit down and get and do a whole chit chat, a whole chit chat video with you all. But a lot has transpired since I got off of line. Like, so much stuff has happened. First of all, the wire in my upper braces popped out. So the fake tooth that was attached to that came off so i'm missing two teeth my wire popped out um i'm waiting on my insurance to let the um oral cert if they go approve what they go approve how much i'm gonna be paid out of pocket but um yeah it's just a a lot of things has happened i'm so grateful for it all though like real talk i'm super grateful for everything oh she got is that the same car i have so but anywho yeah we just in here and i had a little lunchy lunch but yeah let me think what else we're gonna do before we leave this area so once i charge once it charged to a hundred percent because what time is this 210 i want to go to world market and then we're gonna go to our house and um yeah, we're going to go to our house, World Market, and then I'm going, I think I'm going home. My husband going to wash the truck tomorrow, I believe, because it's a car wash right, right here. Y'all see that crew? And we already got the crew sticker. I could just go through, but I'm scared. I don't want to go through. I'm terrified to go through the thing. I don't like that. So, yeah, I know this video everywhere, but like I said... I'm so excited um, for our move, um, our closing date and all of that. I'm excited. 
it's around the corner and I keep visualizing myself just walking through my house and everything like that like I am so excited like y'all don't even know y'all don't even know honey but it's kind of warm in here my god it's warm let me turn this heat off because honey and I have my vest on and my scar because I have on um what you call it um uh, uh active wear sweat sweatpan but um let me see what else i wanted to talk to y'all about mm -hmm. that's kind of it the baby got braces she got her braces she got her uppers on they put the lowers on a couple days before her birthday um she got her glasses she got her uppers her birthday coming up some of her gifts already has come in i do want her to experience she want an american girl dow i want to take her to the american dow store um i think it's downtown chicago so i think we're going to hold it because i was just going to order the dow but i really want her to get that experience i think i'm just going to take her there um during her spring break and let her have that whole experience so i think that's what i want to do oh, i keep touching my face when you ain't supposed to touch your face you're touching your face um yeah but i said that i was doing all the things for myself that i did not do last year all the things that i told y'all that i was doing guess what i'm doing it this year along with purchasing our house so um i got botox today um i get my hair braided every eight weeks so i got my hair done i um i have um i'm a what you call it um i belong to milan loyalty group or whatever they charge you a monthly fee whatever i belong to that so i get laser every six weeks every five to six weeks um what else let me see i'm trying to think um i'm gonna get my eyebrows back microbladed i get those done at the end of the month um I'm getting my lashes back. I think I get my lashes next week. These are my real nails, y'all. Y'all know I wear dip. And I go get those done Monday. So, excuse my nails. But, yeah, I won't be doing, like, no more um, videos in our apartment. Because it just, it don't make sense. If I'm out and about and shopping for the house, I bring y'all along with that. But lately, for real, for real, I just been um, working, like, working my butt off. Um, I've met one of my um, sisters in Christ at our church um, because y'all know we go to church on Saturday and it was a weekend that I was off and I finally met her. We we both are YouTubers and we just was hugging each other. My brother-in-law was like, okay, okay, you know her. <laughs> so I was super excited about that. She was like, you're so pretty. I was like, you are numbers so nikki if you see this video hey boo hey i had caught the covid right after seeing her we had a good time though um it was just a beautiful thing and i wish i stayed in the area so we can be at church more because we stream church and i work every weekend so i can't go to church because i work every weekend and i had that weekend off um because um of personal reasons i had put the pto to take that day off but i had we had a good time we went to church we had family night with my uh my in-loves i call them my in-loves instead of my in-laws and it was just a beautiful thing i was just like i just kept telling my husband thank you for having me be a part of y'all family because we had a good time we had a good time and i was so excited so yeah i think you know we're gonna go up in these stores as as soon as i am done charging we almost done we are at 77 percent so um because yeah y'all know i could talk all day i'll be back please so
Hey y'all, so I just wanted to come really quick because I said that I had a couple products that I wanted to share with you all, okay? So number one is this right here, this Khalifa Farms Matcha Almond Latte with other natural flavors. Baby, it's the green, green tea with almond milk. Baby, I was paying $6 at the Starbucks, the Starbeezies, honey, not no more. Baby, get you some. Watch my video and then run to Target to get this. Right now, it is on sale at Target in your Target app. Click it so you can add the savings, so you can get the savings at the end. This one is almost gone. I don't know if y'all can see. But this one is almost gone. And this is the re-up. So, I got that. I wanted to share that with y'all. Plus, it's only like, I think it's. It might be three points on Weight Watchers because I do Weight Watchers. Then also, I got this Febreze Air Mist Kitchen Odor Fighter Fresh Lemon. It says up to two times. Baby, 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 baby. When I tell you my kitchen, well, it's open concept in my apartment, but baby, it, ta it tastes. It smells like fresh lemons. Go on the screenshot this. Don't say I ain't never put y'all on. I might be late to the party because your girl been off of social media for two months but baby this smells good i also went ahead and picked up the limit the limited edition mrs myers clean day daisy scent i just got the hand soap because i have don detergent yes baby i got that okay she got all the things and then i re-up on my neutrogena rain bath if you know you know don't say i ain't put y'all on on up on nothing okay you see this big box do you see this big box and i wanted two of these they 24.99 you see how big that is i wanted two of them but they only had this one they did have another one i think in rain but i didn't get that one so i did want to share that with y'all that's all my cleaning stuff i mean all my laundry stuff it was everything was on sale I finally found products that work for our, for us as a family unit and smells good and lasts longer. So now we we use Purex and we use Snuggle. So if you use Snuggle, this is $8.39 at Target. It's $6.49. So I got three of these. Of course, we use the Clorox bleach. We use the Purex Natural Ailments and Linen and Lilies. And this is always $9.99. Sometimes they do have, have it on sale. But we got that. We also use Cashmere Downy Scent Boosters along with the Snuggle. When I tell you our clothes smell good for weeks at a time, and I just started using laundries, laundries in my laundry for my intimates. And baby, when I tell you my clothes smell so good. So now I have a system of um, products that we use. We are going to continue using. It's no more trying to figure out what works for our skin. If it don't, if it's not broke, why well, fix it? So that's that. And I wanted to show y'all my hair. So um, she understood the assignment, girlfriends. I got the curly bohemium um, knotless braids, waist length, extra curly, number 27 for the girls who want to know. This is number 27, so I will be a blonde because, honey, we're not dying. My blonde hair, my real hair come to right here. And it it's almost bra length it's almost bra length so i will be rocking braids all year round and all of the things so yeah that's it that's all i wanted to come on and share with you all i pray you all enjoy my video listen if you're not subscribed to my channel go ahead hit the subscribe button click the notification bell tell a friend to tell a friend that your favorite youtuber is back I will be sharing a lot of outings with you all. Not so much stuff in my apartment because our apartment is about to be about to be packed up to the max with like our new furniture, um, boxes, and all of that because we're moving in our house soon. We are at the halfway mark. We are we are about to close. 
we just turned in our notice to vacate this apartment um and i have written the notice by email and then they gave me a paper form to fill out so we did all of that we are almost at the at um what they say you have tunnel vision we're there we're almost at at the end of our <laughs> at the at the end of the tunnel so i'm gonna go ahead and close this vlog out i pray you all have a blessed friday because in real time it is friday no in, in real time it is i want it to be friday it is thursday february the 15th and um so i pray you all have a blessed day uh, and a prosperous weekend ahead and i'll see you all probably next week i might come on here and share some updates i do have some pre-recorded footage so it might i might just make it out of a little short film or something and post that so i'll see you all next week god's will bye